antipsychotic agents. Antipsychotic drugs able to reduce psychotic symptoms in a wide variety of uh, conditions, including schizophrenia, bipolar disorder, uh, psychotic uh, depression, uh, senile uh, psychosis, uh, various organic psychosis, and uh, drug-induced uh, psychosis. They are also able to improve mood and reduce anxiety and sleep uh, disturbances, but there are not the treatment of choice when their symptoms are the primary uh, disturbance uh, in non psychotic uh, patients. A neuroleptic uh, is uh, a subtype. Uh, a subtype of uh, antipsychotic drug that uh, produces a high incidence of uh, uh, extrapyramidal side effects at uh, clinically effective doses or catalepsy in laboratory animals. Uh, typical antipsychotic uh, drugs are now the most widely used uh, type of uh, antipsychotic drug. Uh, the term psychosis uh, denotes a variety of mental disorders, the presence uh, of uh, delusions, uh, various types uh, of hallucina uh, hallucination, usually auditory or visual, but uh, sometimes tactile, um, olfactory, and uh, grossly uh, disorganized uh, thinking in uh, clear sensorium. Schizophrenia is a particular kind of uh, psychosis characterized uh, mainly by a clear uh, sensorium but a marked uh, thinking uh, disturbance. Three uh, subfamilies of um, phenotiazines uh, based primarily on the side chain of uh, the molecular uh, were once the most widely used uh, of the anti psychotic agents. Aliphatic derivatives, uh, for example, chlorpromazine and uh, um, piperidine derivatives, uh, for example, teridazine, the uh, least uh, potent. Uh, this drug produces more sedation and weight uh, uh, gain. Uh, Butyrophenone derivatives. Um, this group of uh, which uh, aloperidol is the most widely used has a very different uh, structure from those of the two preceding groups. Aloperidol, um, butyrophenone is the most widely used typical antipsychotic drug. Um, despite its uh, high level of EPC relative to typical antipsychotic drugs. Um, miscellaneous uh, structures. Um, Pimazet and molidon are typical antipsychotic drugs. Uh, there is no significant difference in FSIC between this never typical and the other typical antipsychotic drugs. And atypical antipsychotic, uh, there are um, uh, clozapine, azenapine, alanzapine, quetiapine, polyridopine, risperidone. Um, uh, ziprazidone, uh, sertindol, um, and uh, aripiprazole. There are atypical antipsychotic drugs. Clozapine is a uh, prototype. Uh, 
these drugs have uh, complex uh, pharmacology, but uh, there uh, are uh, great ability to alter 5-HT to a receptor activity, then to interfere with D2 receptor action. In most cases, they act um, as uh, partial agonists at the 5-HT1A receptor, which produces uh, synergistic effects uh, with 5-HT2A receptor agonism. Most uh, uh, either 5-HT6 or 5-HT7 receptor antagonists. Sulpirid and uh, sulpirid, um, sulpride uh, consisted um, another class of uh, typical agents. They have uh, equivalent uh, potential for D2 and D3 receptors, but there are also 5-HT7 uh, antagonists. However, they also produce market increases in serum prolactin levels and are not as free of the risk of tardive dyskinesia as drugs such as clozapine and quetiapine. And pharmacokinetics. Um, Absorption and distribution of this drug. Most antipsychotic drugs are readily but uh, um, uh, incompletely absorbed. Uh, furthermore, many undergo significant first pass metabolism. Most antipsychotic drugs are highly lipid soluble and uh, uh, protein bond uh, up to 99%. They tend to have large volumes of distribution, usually more than 7 liters per kilogram. They generally have a much longer clinical duration of action than would uh, be estimated uh, from zero plasma half-lives. Li uh, this is uh, paralleled uh, by a prolonged occupancy of D2 dopamine receptors in the brain by the typical antipsychotic drugs. Metabolites of uh, chlorpromazine may be excreted in the urine weeks after the last dose of a uh, chronically administrated drug. Long action injectable formulation uh, may cause some blockage uh, of uh, D2 receptors uh, from six months after the last injection. Time to recurrence of psychotic symptoms is uh, highly variable after discontinuation of antipsychotic drugs. The average time for uh, Relapse in stable patients with uh, schizophrenia who uh, discontinue uh, the medication is six months. Uh, clozapine is uh, exception in that uh, relapse after discontinuation is usually repeat and uh, several. Thus, clozapine should never be discontinued uh, abruptly unless clinically needed because uh, of adverse effects such as myocarditis or agranulocytosis, which are true medical emergencies. Next, metabolism. Most antipsychotic drugs uh, almost completely metabolized by oxidation or demethylation catalyzed by liver microsomal uh, cytochrome P450 uh, uh, enzymes, uh, CYP2, uh, cytochrome P2D6, uh, cytochrome P1A2, uh, and uh, cytochrome uh, P3A4 are the major uh, in, uh, isoforms involved. 
drug drug interaction interaction should be considered when uh, combining antipsychotic drugs with various other uh, psychotropic drug or drug uh, such as ketoconazole that inhibit various cytochrome uh, P system enzymes. As a typical clinical doses, antipsychotic drug uh, uh, don't usually interfere with the metabolism of other drugs. And pharmacodynamics, the first uh, um, phenotiazine antipsychotic drug with uh, chlorpromazine as a prototype uh, uh, proved to have a wide variety of central nervous system, autonomic and endocrine effects. And so um, efficacy of uh, these drugs is primarily uh, driven by D2 receptor uh, blockhead. Uh, there are adverse actions uh, where trace it to blocking uh, effects uh, at a wide uh, range of receptors, including alpha adrenaline receptor and muscarinic, H1 histaminic and uh, 5 H2, HT2 receptors. Uh, short information about dopaminergic uh, systems. Five. Uh, dopaminergic systems or pathways uh, important for understanding schizophrenia and the mechanism of action antipsychotic drugs. The first pathway, the one most closely related to behavior and uh, psychosis is a, a mesolimbic, mesocortical pathway which project from cell bodies in the ventral um, tegmentum in sep uh, separate uh, bundles of uh, axons to the limbic system and neocortex. The second system, the uh, nigra stri uh, uh, um, striatal pathway blocked uh, of the D two receptors in the nigrostriatal pathway is responsible for EPS. The third pathway, the uh, tubero in fundibular system, dopamine released by the uh, neurons psychologically inhibits uh, prolactin secretion from the anterior pituitary. The fourth dopaminergic system, the medullary uh, periventricular pathway, uh, C. This uh, system may be involved uh, in 18 behavior. The fifth pathway, the insert uh, hippocampic pathway. It uh, appears to regular the anticipatory. Uh, motivational phase of uh, cor uh, corpulatory behavior in rats. The antipsychotic action is now those uh, uh, to be produced uh, by their ability to block the effect of dopamine to inhibit the activity of adenylate class in the mesolimbic system. Uh, so, a difference amongst antipsychotic drugs. As well as all effective antipsychotic drugs uh, block D2 receptors. The degree of this blockade uh, in relation to other actions on receptors varies considerably uh, among drugs. The nevest aripiprazole appears to be a partial agonist of D2 receptors. Uh, varying uh, degrees of antagonism of alpha-2 adrenal receptors uh, also seen with risperidone, uh, olanzapine, clozapine, aripiprazole, and quetiapine. Effects. 
most antipsychotic uh, drug cause a pleasure uh, 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 unpleasant uh, subjective effects in non-psychotic individuals. The mild uh, to uh, reverse uh, uh, epis, uh, including akatasia, uh, sleepiness, uh, autonomic effects, uh, uh, restlessness, uh, uh, unlike and associated with more familiar uh, sedation or hypnotics. Um, low doses of some of these drugs, particularly uh, quetiapine, are used to uh, promote sleep onset and uh, maintenance. Uh, also, uh, there is no approved indication for such usage. People without uh, psychiatric illness given antipsychotic drugs, uh, even at low doses, experience implied uh, performance uh, as uh, Jude get by number of uh, uh, psychomotor and uh, uh, psychometric tests, um, psychotic uh, individuals, however, may actually uh, show improvement in this performance as the psychosis is uh, uh, elevated. Mm -hmm. uh, Electroencephalographic effects. Antipsychotic drugs produce shifts in the pattern of electroencephalographic EEG uh, frequencies, usually uh, slowing them and increasing this uh, um, uh, synchronization. Some of the uh, neuroleptic agents lower this uh, seizure uh, threshold and uh, induce EEG patterns typical of uh, uh, seizure disorders. However, with uh, careful dosage titration, most can be used to safety in epileptic patients. Next, endocrine effects. Other typical antipsychotic drugs, as well as uh, risperidone, um, uh, polyperidone, produce ele uh, elevation of uh, prolactin. Never antipsychotics such as alanzapine, quetiapine, aripiprazole cause no or minimal increases of prolactin and reduce it uh, risk of uh, extrapyramidal system dysfunction and uh, uh, tardy dyskinesia, um, reflecting this uh, di uh, diminished uh, D2 antagonism. Next, cardiovascular effect. Um, the low potency phenytoin frequently cause orthostatic uh, um, hypotension and tachycardia, prolongation of QT interval and abnormal configuration of the ST segment and T valves. These changes are readily reserved by withdrawal um, uh, the drug. Uh, psychiatric indication. Uh, schizophrenia is a primary indication for antipsychotic uh, agents. Antipsychotic drugs uh, also used to vary extensively in patients with psychotic bipolar disorder, BP, mm, uh, a short name, BP1, psychotic depression and treatment resistant depression. Catatonic forms of schizophrenia are best managed by intravenous benzodiazepines. Antipsychotic drugs may be needed to treat psychotic 
components of that form of the illness after catatonia has ended and they remain the uh, mainstay of treatment for this condition. Unfortunately, many patients show little response and uh, uh, virtually non show a complete response. Antipsychotic drugs are uh, also indicated uh, for uh, schizoaffective disorders, which uh, share <clears throat> characteristic of both schizophrenia and affective disorders. The manic uh, phase in bipolar affective disorder often requires uh, treatment with antipsychotic agents, though uh, lithium or Valproic acid supplement with high potency benzodiazepine, for example, clonazepine or lorazepam may su uh, suffice in mild cases. Aripiprazole, quetiapine, alanzapine, um, ziprazidone, and risperidone have been approved for treatment of various phases of bipolar disorder. They are most effective for the manic phase and for uh, maintenance uh, treatment. As mania subsides, uh, the antipsychotic drug may be withdrawal. Uh, also, maintenance uh, treatment with atypical antipsychotic agents has become more common. Non-manic excited uh, states may also be managed uh, by antipsychotics often in combination with benzodiazepines. And other indications for the use of antipsychotic include the Tourette syndrome, um, distributed behavior in a patient with uh, uh, Alzheimer's disease and with antidepressant psychotic depression. Antipsychotics are not uh, indicate for the treatment of various withdrawal syndromes, for example, opioid withdrawal. Non-psychiatric indication. Most older typical antipsychotic drugs, with the exception of uh, 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 tyrosidine, have a strong anti effect. This action is due to dopamine receptor blockade. Both centrally in the chemoreceptor trigger zone of the medulla and uh, on receptor in the stomach, uh, it's uh, peripherally. Some drugs such as uh, chloro, um, uh, chloro, um, no, uh, benzquinamide and uh, uh, prochlorpyrazine uh, promote uh, solely as antimatics. Choose among antipsychotic drugs uh, is based mainly on a difference in adverse effects and possible difference in efficacy. Science use of the older drug is still widespread, especially for patients treated in the public uh, sector, uh, knowledge of such agents as chlorpromazine and galopiridor, uh, galopiridol remains uh, relevant. Thus, uh, one should uh, be familiar with one member of each of the three uh, subfamilies of uh, mm, Phenotiazines, a uh, member of the um, thioxantine and uh, butyrophenone group, and all of the never uh, compounds uh, uh, clozapine, olanzapine, risperidone, quetiapine, aripiprazole, and uh, riprazidone. Each may have special benefits for selected patients. Uh, for approximately 70% of patients with schizophrenia and probably for a similar 
a proportion of patients with uh, bipolar disorder, uh, with uh, psychotic uh, um, features, uh, typical and atypical antipsychotic drugs um, of uh, uh, equal uh, efficacy for treating positive symptoms. However, the widens uh, favor atypical drugs uh, for benefit for negative symptoms and uh, um, co uh, cognition <clears throat> for um, diminished uh, risk of uh, tardive dyskinesia and other form of EPS uh, and uh, for uh, less increases in uh, prolactin levels. Some of the typical antipsychotic drugs uh, produce more weight uh, gain and increases in lipids than some typical antipsychotic drugs. A small uh, percentage of patients uh, uh, develop diabetes mellitus, most uh, often seen with uh, clozapine, alanzapine. Uh, ziprazidone is a atypical drug causing the uh, least uh, weight gain. Um, Polyperidone, uh, aripiprazole, and risperidone usually produce small increases in weight and lipids. Asinapine and quetiapine have uh, intermediate effect. Olanzapine and clozapine frequently result uh, in large increases in weight and uh, lipids. The range of effective dosage among various antipsychotic agents is broad. Therapeutic uh, uh, margins are uh, uh, substantial. At appropriate dosage, antipsychotics uh, with uh, exception of clozapine and uh, uh, perhaps uh, alanzapine of uh, equal efficacy in broadly selected uh, groups of patients. However, some patients who fail to respond to one drug may respond to another. For this reason, several drugs may have to be uh, treated uh, to find of the one most effective for individual patient. Patient who have become refractory to two or three antipsychotic agents given in substantial doses become uh, candidates uh, for treatment with clozapine or high dose olanzapine. 30 to 50% of patients previously uh, refractory to standard uh, doses of other antipsychotic drugs respond to these drugs. In such cases, in, uh, increased risk of clozapine can well be justified. Well tolerated. Um, Parenteral forms of the high potency older drug aliperidol and uh, uh, flufinazine uh, are variable uh, for repeat initiation of treatment as well as for maintenance uh, treatment in non uh, compli uh, uh, compliant uh, uh, patients. And side effects. Most of the unwanted effects of antipsychotic drugs and extensions of the nudge pharmacology action, but a few effects are allergic in nature and some um, idiosyncrasic. And uh, 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 large group behavioral effects, uh, the older typical antipsychotic drugs are unpleasant to, uh, to take. Many patients stop taking uh, those drugs because of the adverse effects, uh, which may be uh, imitated uh, by giving small doses during the day and the major uh, portion at the bedtime. 
pseudo-depression that may be due to drug-induced akinesia, usually responds to treatment with anti-Parkinsonism drugs. Uh, other pseudo-depression uh, may be due to uh, higher doses than needed in partially remitted patient, in which case decreasing the dose may relieve the symptoms. Toxic uh, confusional states may occur with very high doses of drugs that have uh, prominent anti-muscarinic uh, action. Extrapyramidal reaction occurring early during treatment with older agents include typical Parkinson's syndromes, uh, akathisia, uh, it's uh, uncontrollable uh, restlessness, and acute dystonic reaction. It's a uh, spastic uh, retrocollins or uh, torticollins. Effects most patients are able to uh, tolerate uh, the anti-muscarinic effects, uh, um, uh, adverse effects of antipsychotic drugs. Those uh, who are made too uh, incomfortable, uh, who develop renal uh, retention or other uh, several symptoms uh, can be uh, switch it uh, to an agent uh, with a significant anti-muscarinic action, orthostatic hypotension or impaired uh, ejaculation, common complication of the uh, therapy with uh, uh, chlorpromazine um, and uh, uh, miseridazine should be managed uh, by switching to drug with less market adrenal receptor blocking action. Weight gain is very common, especially with clozapine and telanzapine and requires monitoring of food intake, uh, especially um, carbohydrates. Um, hyper Glycerinemia may develop insulin resistance and increased lipids should uh, uh, hyper um, prolactinemia in women results in the amenorrhea, uh, galactaria uh, syndrome, and uh, uh, infertility. In men, loss of libido, impotence, and uh, uh, infertility may result. Uh, Hyperprolactinemia uh, may cause osteoporosis, particularly in women, if dose reducing is not indicated or ineffective in uh, controlling this patient, pattern, uh, switching to one of the atypical agents that uh, don't raise uh, prolactin levels. For example, ribeprazole may be indicated. Um, Lazepine causes uh, granulocytosis in a small but significant number of patients, approximately up uh, one uh, uh, up two persons of uh, those treated. Next, uh, ocular complications. Um, this posits uh, in the anterior uh, portions of the eye uh, cornea and lens, uh, common complication of chlorpromazine therapy. They may uh, accentuate uh, the normal processes of aging uh, of the lens. Theoridazine uh, is the only antipsychotic drug that causes retinal uh, deposits, uh, which in Advanced uh, cases may resemble retinitis uh, pigmentosa. The deposits are uh, usually associated with uh, um, browning of uh, vision. 
cardiotoxicity. Overdoses of uh, tyridazine associated with major uh, ventricular arrhythmias, for example, tracide points, cardiac uh, uh, conduction block, and uh, sudden death. Clozapine is sometimes associated with myocarditis and must be discontinued if myocarditis uh, manifests. Uh, for pregnancy, um, so dysmorphogenesis, uh, so antipsychotic drugs appear to be relatively safe in pregnancy, a small increase in teratogenic risk could be missed. Um, questions about the whether to use this drug during pregnancy and whether uh, to abort a pregnancy in which the fetus has already been exposed must uh, be decided individually. If a pregnant woman could manage uh, to be free of antipsychotic drug during pregnancy, this would be desirable because of uh, the effect of the neurotransmitters uh, involved in neuro uh, development. Side effect, neuroleptic malignant syndrome. This life uh, treating, uh, treat, uh, treating disorder occurs in patients who are extremely uh, sensitive um, to the extrapyramidal effects of antipsychotic uh, agent. The initial symptom is marked uh, muscle uh, rigidity. If uh, sweating is impaired as it often is during treatment with anticholinergic uh, drugs, Fever may uh, answer often reaching uh, dangerous levels. The stress like acetosis and high fever associated with uh, this syndrome may erroneously suggest, uh, suggest uh, an infection process. Autonomic uh, instability with altered blood pressure and uh, pulse rate is often present. Muscle type creating kinase levels are usually <coughs> elevated reflecting muscle uh, damage. This syndrome is believed to, to result from uh, excessively rapid blockage of uh, postsynaptic uh, dopamine receptors. Several forms of extrapyramidal syndrome following early in the course um, uh, vigorous uh, treatment of the extrapyramidal syndrome uh, with anti-Parkinsonism uh, drug is uh, uh, worthwhile. Muscle relaxants, uh, particularly diazepam, uh, often useful. Other muscle relaxants uh, such as uh, dantralin, um, dopamine agonist, uh, such as uh, bromocriptine, have been reported to be uh, helpful. If fever is uh, present, cooling uh, by uh, physical measure uh, should be treated. Various minor uh, form of this syndrome are now recognized. Uh, switching uh, to an atypical drug effect recovery uh, is uh, indicated. Antipsychotic uh, produce more important pharmacodynamic uh, than ph pharmacokinetic interaction because of these multiple effects. Uh, additive effects may occur when these drugs uh, combined with other that have sedative effects. Alpha adrenal receptor blocking action, anticholinergic uh, uh, effects, and for uh, um, Tiridazine and Ziprazidone, uh, uh, um, quinidine-like uh, action. 
a variety of pharmacokinetic interaction have been reported, but none of major clinical significance. Uh, poisoning with antipsychotic agent uh, rarely fatal with the uh, exception of uh, those due to miseridazine and uh, tiridazine. Uh, In general, draw signs uh, proceeds uh, to coma with um, intervening uh, period of uh, agitation. Neuromuscular excitability may be increased and uh, processed uh, to convulsion uh, papules, um, meotic and uh, deep tendon reflexes decrease it. Hypotension and uh, hypothermia um, rule. Uh, so fever may be present later in the course. The later effects of uh, mesoridazine and uh, tiridazine related to induction of ventricular tachyarrhythmias. Patients should be given the usual ABCD treatment for poison, uh, uh, poisoning um, and uh, treated um, supportively. And uh, next disease, bipolar disorder once known as a manic depressive illness was a concept of as a psychotic disorders distinct uh, from schizophrenia at the end of the 18th century before that both of these disorders were considered a part of a continuum it's uh, ironic that the weight of the avoidance today is that um, there is a profound overlap in the disorders. This is not to say that there are no pathophysiologically, uh, pathophysiologically important uh, difference or that some drug uh, treatments are different uh, differentially effective in these disorders. Lithium was the first agent shown to be useful in the treatment of the manic phase uh, of bipolar disorder that was not also an uh, antipsychotic drug. Lithium has knowledge use in schizophrenia. Lithium continues uh, to be used uh, for acute uh, uh, face illness as well as for prevention of recurrence manic and depressive episodes. A group of mood stabilizing drugs, there are also anticonvulsant agents, has become more widely used than lithium. In, it uh, includes uh, carbamazepine and valproic acid, for the treatment of acute mania and uh, for prevention of its recurrence. Lamotrigine uh, is um, approved for prevention of uh, recurrence. Uh, chlorpromazine, aripiprazole, quetiapine, risperidone, olanzapine, and um, ziprazidone approved uh, by the FDA for treatment of the manic phase of uh, bipolar disorder. Um, fluoxetine together with alanzapine in combination and uh, mm, quetiapine approved uh, for treatment of bipolar depression. Um, lithium is small uh, monovalent uh, cation and uh, you can see pharmacokinetics uh, of lithium drugs and uh, pharmacodynamics. Uh, despite considerable uh, investigations, the biochemical basis uh, for mood stabilization uh, therapies, including lithium and anticonvulsant, uh, most stabilizing is not clearly 
understood. Lithium directly inhibits uh, two signal transduction um, uh, pathways. It both suppresses uh, inositol signaling uh, thus uh, depletion of um, in, uh, intracellular inositol and inhibit um, glycogen synthase uh, cannot 3. The pathway that uh, uh, facilitated in this manner modulated energy metabolism provide neuroprotection and increase uh, neuroplasticity. Uh, While proic acid may indirectly reduce um, glutathione uh, uh, GCK3 activately and can upregulate uh, gen expression thus inhibition of uh, gistone uh, desetilase. Valproic acid also inhibits uh, inositol signaling uh, thus um, inositol uh, depletion mechanism. And effects uh, on electrolytes and ion. Transport lithium is closely related to sodium in its uh, properties. It can substitute uh, for sodium in generation action potentials and in natrium um, and natrium exchange across the membrane. It inhibits uh, the latter process that is lithium natrium exchange is gradually sloped after lithium is uh, introduced uh, into the body. A therapeutic concentration uh, near one millimole per liter. It does not significantly affect the natrium calcium uh, exchanger or the natrium calcium at uh, the uh, uh, pump. <coughs> Drug interaction. <coughs> Renal clearance of lithium <coughs> is reduced about 25% uh, by uh, diuretics, for example, diazids. And doses may need to be reduced by a similar amount. A similar reduction in lithium clearance has been noted with several of the never non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs that block synthesis of uh, uh, prostaglandins. This interaction has not been reported for either aspirin or uh, acetaminophen. All uh, neuroleptic tests to date with the possible exception of uh, glozapine and the neurotypical antipsychotic may produce more severe extrapyramidal syndromes. Uh, when uh, combined uh, with lithium. Side effect. Uh, many side effects associated with lithium treatment occur at the varying times after treatment is started. Some are uh, harmless, but it's important to be alert uh, to adverse effects uh, that may significantly impend in uh, uh, serious toxic reaction. Uh, tremor is one of the most common uh, side effects of lithium treatment, and uh, it occurs with therapeutic doses, propranolol, atenolol, uh, which have been reported uh, to be effective in essential tremor. Also, elevate uh, lithium inducer tremor as a reported uh, neurologic uh, abnormalities include uh, um, horia um, tetosis, uh, motor hyperactivity, ataxia, desertria, aphasia, uh, psychiatric uh, disturbances, uh, toxic concentration, uh, generally marked by mental confusion and withdrawal appearance of any new neurologic uh, or psychiatric symptoms of 
you will see this uh, clear indication for um, temporarily stopping treatment with uh, lithium and for close monitoring of serum levels. Uh, decreased steroid function. Lithium probably decreases the steroid function in most patients exposed to the drug, but the effect is reversible or uh, non-progressive. Few patients develop uh, frank <clears throat> steroid uh, enlargement and uh, febrile still show symptoms of hypothyroidism. Uh, polydipsia and uh, polyuria common but uh, reversible uh, concomitant of lithium treatment occurring uh, at therapeutic serum concentra uh, concentration. Edema is common a side effect of lithium treatment and may be related to some effect of lithium on uh, sodium retention. The bradycardia, tachycardia, sick sinus syndrome is a definite uh, contraindication to the use of lithium because they yawn uh, for the depression the sinus node. And about pregnancy, renal clearance of lithium increases during pregnancy and uh, reverts uh, to lower levels immediately. After delivery, a patient with serum lithium concentration is in a good therapeutic range during pregnancy may develop toxic levels after delivery. Special care in monitoring lithium levels is needed in these times. Lithium is uh, transferred to nursing infants there's breast milk in which it uh, has a concentration about uh, one third to one half then of serum. And overdose. <clears throat> Therapeutic overdoses of lithium are more common uh, than those due to liberate or accidental uh, in, uh, ingestion of the drug because lithium is a small um, ion, it's uh, um, dialyzed uh, readily. Both peritoneal dialysis and the hemodialysis are effective, so the latter is uh, preferred. Next drug, valproic acid, valprat, as an uh, antiepileptic. Uh, has been demonstrated to have anti-monic effects and is now being widely used for this indication. While proic acid and um, appro uh, appropriate first-line treatment for mania. Carbamazepine has been considered uh, to be a reasonable uh, alternative to lithium when the uh, latter is less than optimally uh, efficiencies. Carbamazepine may be used uh, to treat uh, acute mania and also for uh, prophylactic therapy. Carbamazepine may be used alone or a refractory patient in combination with lithium or rarely valproate. The use of carbamazepine as mood stabilizer is uh, similar to its use as uh, anticonvulsant. Next drug, uh, lamotrigine, has been reported to be useful in uh, preventing uh, the depression that often following the manic phase of bipolar disorders. Uh, next group of drug, antidepressant agent, uh, and uh, we to start from uh, classification. Selective serotonin uh, reuptake inhibitors. The selective serotonin reuptake inhibitors, SSRIs, uh, represent a chemically um, 
uh, diverse uh, class of agents uh, that have uh, their primary action, the inhibition of the serotonin transporter, CERT. There are currently six available SSRIs uh, and that there are the most common antidepressants in clinical use. In addiction to this use in major depression, SSRIs uh, have uh, indication in um, general uh, anxiety disorders, uh, um, post-traumatic uh, stress disorders, uh, uh, OCD, panic disorders, MDD, uh, uh, it's um, depression and bulimia. The popularity of SSRIs uh, stems largely uh, from their ease of use, safety in overdose, relative tolerability, cost, uh, all except uh, acetylopramma generally available and broad uh, spectrum of use, serotonin, uh, norepinephrine, reuptake inhibitors. Two classes of antidepressant uh, act uh, as combined uh, serotonin and uh, norepinephrine uh, reuptake inhibitors, selective serotonin, norepinephrine reuptake inhibitors, SNRIs and uh, TCRs. Uh, selective serotonin nor epinephrine reuptake inhibitors include uh, venlafaxine. It's metabolite uh, uh, this venlafaxine and duloxetine. SNRIs uh, also used in the treatment of uh, generalized anxiety, stress, urinary incontinence and vasomotor symptoms of menopause. Next, tricyclic antidepressants. Imipramine is highly anticholinergic uh, um, anti and uh, relatively strong serotonin as well as non-norepinephrine reuptake inhibitors. In contrast, uh, this epramine is much less anticholinergic uh, and uh, more potent uh, and uh, somewhat more selective norepinephrine reuptake inhibitor uh, than is uh, imipramine. At the present time, the tricyclic antidepressants used primarily in depression that is uh, unresponsive uh, to more commonly use antidepressants such as uh, uh, selective serotonin, uh, RIS, uh, SSRIs or SNRIs. Uh, there are lots of popularity. Uh, popularity uh, stems uh, in large part from relatively uh, poorer tolerability uh, compared with never agent uh, to uh, diffuse uh, um, difficultly of use uh, and uh, to lately in overdose other used uh, for tricyclic antidepressants include uh, the treatment of pain uh, conditions uh, enuresis uh, insomnia next group 5HT2 antagonists Two antidepressants are sourced to act uh, primarily antagonist uh, at the 5-HT2 receptor, trazodone and nefazodone. The most common use of trazodone in current um, practice is uh, as uh, unlabeled um, hypnotic science. It's... Uh, highly sedation and not associated with tolerance or uh, dependence. Nefazodone is chemically related to trazodone. Nefazodone re uh, received uh, an FDA uh, black box uh, warning. Implication in the in uh, hepatotoxicity, including uh, level cases of uh, uh, hepatic failure. 
so next. Tetracyclic and unicyclic antidepressants. A number of antidepressants do not fit neatly into the other classes among their uh, bupropion, mirtazapine, amoxapine, and um, mapratiline. Bupropion somewhat uh, resemble amphetamine in the chemical uh, structure and uh, like the stimulant uh, has central nervous system, uh, CNS, uh, short uh, uh, activation uh, properties. Mirtazapine has a uh, tetracyclic chemical structure and belong, belong uh, to the periphery uh, piperazine azepine group of um, compounds. Monoamide oxidase inhibitors now rarely used in clinical practice because of toxically and potential leather food and uh, drug interaction. Their primary use uh, now is in the treatment of depression and is positive to other antidepressants. The antidepressants uh, share uh, several pharmacokinetic uh, uh, features. Most have fairly rapid oral absorption, achieve peak plasma levels within uh, two or three hours, uh, uh, tightly bound to plasma uh, proteins under uh, hepatic metabolism and uh, renally clear. However, even the classes, the pharmacokinetics of individual antidepressants varies considerably. And pharmacodynamic, yes. Uh, all currently available antidepressants enhance monoamine neurotransmission by one of several mechanisms. The most common mechanism is inhibition of the activity of CERT, NET, or both monoamine uh, uh, transporters. Antidepressants that inhibit CERT, NET, or both include the SSRIs and SNRIs, by definition, uh, and the uh, tricyclic antidepressants. Another mechanism for increasing the availability of uh, monoamines is the inhibition of those enzymatic uh, um, degradation uh, um, mouse. And detention uh, strategies uh, for enhancing monoamine um, can include the binding uh, presynaptic outer receptors, uh, for example, mirtazapine, or specific postsynaptic receptors, um, it's a uh, 5-HT2 antagonist and mirtazapine. Unlimitedly the increased availability of monoamines for binding in the sympathetic uh, cleft uh, results uh, in uh, cascade of events that enhance the uh, uh, transcription of some uh, proteins and the inhibition of other. It's a net uh, uh, production of those uh, proteins, including BDNF, glucocorticoid receptors, beta adrenaline receptors, and other proteins that appears uh, to determine the benefits as well as the toxicity of a given agent. Clinical indication, depression. Psychotherapy is often combined with antidepressant treatment and the combination appears more effective than other uh, strategy along the anxiety disorders after major depression. Anxiety disorders represent the most uh, common application of antidepressant uh, post-traumatic uh, uh, stress disorders is manifesting uh, uh, when traumatic of life uh, um, uh, threatening uh, even results in uh, intrusive uh, anxiety provoking thirst or emergency hypervigilance um, 
nightmare mars and uh, uh, avoidance of uh, situation that uh, remain the patient of the trauma. SSRIs uh, considering uh, first line treatment for PTSD and uh, can benefit a number of symptoms, including anxiety and hypervigilance. Other treatment, including psychotherapy, butic, uh, uh, Intervention uh, usually required uh, in addition to antidepressant. Next, pain disorders. Antidepressants process analgesic uh, properties independent of the mood uh, effects. Tricyclic have been used in the treatment of neuropathic and other pain condition. Um, medication that uh, process both uh, uh, norepinephrine and the uh, 5-HT rock take blocking um, properties are uh, often useful in treating pain disorders. Accenting uh, corticospinal monoamine pathway appear to be important in the endogenous analgetic uh, system. In addition, chronic pain uh, conditions uh, commonly associated with major depression. Tricyclic uh, antidepressants continue to be commonly used uh, for some of the condition and SNRIs uh, increase in bliss, uh, in bliss used. Duloxetine was approved uh, for the treatment of chronic joint and muscle pain. Uh, this venlafaxin been uh, investigated uh, for a variety of pain uh, condition from uh, post um, no uh, uh, therapeutic uh, uh, neurogia um, it's um, chronic back pain next uh, premenstrual um, dysphoric uh, disorders. Um, it's um, SSRIs are known to beneficial to many women with uh, premenstrual uh, disorder and fluoxetine and sertraline have been approved for this indication. Treating for two weeks out of the month in the uh, luteal phase may be effective as uh, a continuous uh, treatment. Uh, the repeat effect of SSRIs uh, in MDD may be associated with repeat increases in uh, um, pregnant and long uh, levels. Uh, next, smoking uh, cessation. Bupropion was approved as a treatment for smoking um, cessation. Next, eating disorders. Uh, bulimia nevrosa and anorexia nevrosa potentially uh, devastating disorders. Bulimia is characterized by episode intake of large amount of food, uh, following by um, uh, ritualistic uh, purging uh, throughs, amazes the use of uh, laxatives uh, or other methods. Medical compli uh, complication of the um, purging, um, such as uh, hypokalemia, common and uh, dangerous anorexia disorders in which reduced food intake results, uh, loss of weight of 15% or more of ideal body weight, and the person has a morbid fear of gaining weight and highly distorted body image. Anorexia is often chronic and may be fatal in 10% uh, or more of cases. Antidepressants are to be helpful in the treatment of uh, bulimia, but not anorexia. And fluoxetine was approved for the treatment of bulimia and other antidepressants have shown benefit in reducing the uh, binge poor cycle. The primary treatment for anorexia at this time is uh, refeeding family therapy and cognitive behavioral therapy. Bupropion may uh, 
has some benefits in treatment obesity. Non-depressed uh, obese uh, patients treated uh, with bupropion were able to lose some but uh, more weight and uh, maintain the loss relay relative to a similar population treated uh, with placebo. However, the weight loss was not robust uh, and there are appears um, to be more effective option for weight loss. Uh, Off-label usage. Antidepressants are used for many other on and off-label application and raises in child uh, is older label used uh, for the tricyclic antidepressant but they are less commonly used not because there are side effects the duloxetine provide in europe uh, for the treatment uh, urinary stress incontinence um, many of the serotonin uh, uh, Energic antidepressants uh, appear to be helpful for treating quasimotor symptoms in uh, perimenopause. Oh, side effects. So some potential uh, side effects are common to all antidepressants. Most of the uh, side effects uh, uh, specific to a uh, subclass of agents and to their pharmacodynamic effect. And the FDA warning applied to, to all antidepressants is the risk increases suicidally um, in patients under the age 63 year old. So a small minority of patients may experience a treatment emergent increase in suicidal um, in addition with antidepressants, the absence uh, of treatment of a uh, major depressive episode in all age groups is a particularly important risk factor in the completed uh, suicides. And you can see um, uh, in this slide, um, markers of uh, high risk of uh, suicidal ideation. So, uh, and selective serotonin reuptake inhibitors, adverse effect. Next slide, serotonin norepinephrine reuptake inhibitors and tricyclic antidepressants, uh, side effect. Next, uh, five HT2 antagonist uh, side effects. Tetracyclic uh, and unicyclic uh, uh, antidepressant side effects. Monoamine oxidase inhibitor side effects. You can see dangerous drug interaction of antidepressants. Selective serotonin reuptake inhibitors. Mm -hmm. uh, next, selective serotonin norepinephrine reuptake inhibitors uh, and uh, tricyclic antidepressants. Mm -hmm. 5-HT2 antagonists. Tetracyclic and unicyclic antidepressants. Maui's monoamine oxidase inhibitors. And you can see several uh, tables with common information about all group antipsychotic drugs and antidepressant drugs. Thank you for your attention.